Welcome to Lakeshore. I'll be showing you your Arctic Wolf today. In your front compartment, you're going to have your spare tire as well as your deep cell battery. Battery disconnect right behind the battery. Right to the right, you're going to have docking lights, um, auto leveling panel here, up and down to turn it on at the exact same time. Green LED light will indicate it's on. Auto level to level out your unit. Hitch height is going to be that location right before you hit auto level. It'll bring up your rear jacks and put your front at that height. Retract all after you connect to your truck. Hit retract all, that will bring all your jacks up. You have two 20 pound LP tanks, both full. Regulators are going to be on the passenger side. In your pass through, you got a 50 amp cord. Right to the right of your pass through door on your driver's side, you're going to have a manual light here. Switches underneath. Right below, you're going to have water input. This is going to be to fill the tank, city connection. You want to use the water pressure as well as the water off the water hose. Right above, you're going to have inlets for cable and satellite. Right to the right, you're going to have black tank flush. Just know don't hook a hose up here unless your valves are open. If you got a full black tank, you're going to overfill your bathroom. Right to the right, you're going to have your furnace. This gets extremely hot, so make sure nothing's leaning up against it. Your poles and your connection is going to be right underneath there. Right to the right, you're going to have your water heater. On your slide out on the driver's side, you're going to have a little compartment. This little compartment's going to have sewer hose, 30 to 50 amp adapter, as well as a 30 to 15 amp adapter. To the right of the slide out, you're going to have your outdoor shower. It's going to be hot and cold. Right to the right of that, you're going to have your 50 amp hookup. On the back side, you got your luggage rack. I wouldn't recommend anything over 300 pounds. On your passenger side here, going up to your door, your awning as well as your awning lights are controlled from the panel inside, right in your pass through here. You're going to have connections for outdoor TV, your other 20 pound LP tank regulator. It's going to be right above it. It's going to be a knob. Turn it to the right. You're going to use the driver's side tank. Point it all the way to the Twist it left, you'll use the tank right here. Going inside your unit, right when you walk in, you're gonna see a black panel. That's gonna be breakers and fuses. Right above the steps, you're gonna have your control panel. You'll be able to get the app from a one control app there, as, and then you'll be able to control all, everything from digital. Right below the Arctic Wolf, you're gonna have these little buttons here that will show you your levels in your unit. Right below that, you're gonna have water pump and water heater here. Inside LED, outside LED, living room, kitchen lights. On a control here, slide one is gonna be the slide with the fireplace. Slide two will be the slide with the couch there. Thermostat right next to it. Bar down on the bottom is the mode selector. You'll be able to go to AC, heat, or a fan and control your temp from the up and downs. Right on the right side here is gonna control, uh, you're gonna be able to see your voltage on your battery. Of course, the digital side, you'll be able to access your leveling as well as awning, lights, and slides. Going in your master bedroom here, you're gonna have two switches right when you walk in to the left. One switch is gonna control the blue LED and the other one's gonna control the main lights. Now, the lights uh, above the pillows there are push button lights. They got a button in the dead center you have to push. You have charging stations on each side of the bed. Bathroom's pretty self-explanatory. You got a GFI breaker to the right of the sink here, as well as these lights in here are push buttons. Push button lights, you see the button here, you'll just push. You'll have another one above the shower. You have a little night light above the sink here. Coming into your kitchen area, kitchen area, big pantry, kitchen light, that kitchen light is gonna be these two lights here. With charging station, your keys are on your sink here, as well as you have uh, microwave, stove top. My, your stove top's just gonna work as you're gonna turn it over to high, use your igniter on the left side. Vent controls are just like at your house. Above, you got tap lights here, push buttons. Entertainment center. Entertainment, you got a switch back here to turn on LED lights here, as well as your cable output for your living room TV. Audio, you're gonna have two zones. You're gonna have a zone one and a zone two. One's gonna be outside, one's gonna be inside. Here you have your fireplace. Just know your bigger items aren't gonna work without shore power. On the back wall here, you got individual lights. These are push buttons here with charging stations at each side of this couch. Your recliners, you have individual tap lights above as well as inside your kitchen. 
you have a push button light here. That's going to complete our video. Thank you for choosing Lakeshore. Have a great day.